flex, she wanna know me I stay low-key, all gas, no brakes Baby, let them hoes sleep Body on 10, make your girl OD I get in my way, never out of my lane Feel like you the one and I'm on one So what is gonna be? What's up guys and welcome back to my channel In today's video, I will be showing you guys How to make bottle cap badge ribs So with no further ado, let's just jump right into this video Okay, you're gonna start off. This is your supplies you're gonna need. I have some leaves here, like different colors. I don't know if you can hear me or not for the bees being so loud, but these are the bees I have here. Um, just different color bees, different styles, and stuff like that. Got some Valentine's Day colors, some um, Minnie Mouse, Mickey Mouse colors. I got some colorful ones. I got my badge ribs. I got my images. And I got my glue dots. And I got my bottle caps. Okay, you're going to start off with your moodies out the way. With your images here. I cut one of them out. I was just experimenting. Because I never used this thing before. You know, I'm so used to Cricket doing everything for you. I was like, you know, let me try this little thing in my jig out here. So it's just a um, hole puncher. It's to cut it. Um, it's to cut your images out. You know, give you like that perfect circle, which the cricket does the same thing. But nevertheless, um, I'm gonna try it. I tried it one time and it was okay, but I'm going to get these cut out. Now that I have my images cut out, I am going to match up, you know, my body caps, which I ordered these from Amazon. I just put them in this jar. Um, they come in a bag, but you get like a lot of different colors. So I know for the gray one, I definitely want to use the pink one. So I have two of those. Stuck together. Look how thin they are. Like they be stuck together. It's those. And I'm gonna use white for this one. Cute. <clears throat> and I'll probably use red. Nah. Let's see. I was undecided about that one. I got black. Let's see what black looks like. Okay. Black in. Let's do. Let's see. Uh, I like the yellow. So now that we have our bottle caps and our images cut out, you want to take your adhesive glue dots. And what I like to do is pick them up, like lift them up off the paper like that. And then just grab the end of them. And I try not to touch the bottom part because this part right here it is sticky so I take my glue dot and I take it and I put it right over my image center this is tedious put it right right over it 
just like that. Let's see if I can zoom in for you guys. Just like that. I think it's upside down. Yep. Just like that. Perfect. Then you just place it right right back in your little cap and you go on and you do the rest of them. Now that our blue dots are all in place, we are going to take your E6000 glue. Okay, we're back. I had to get my glue from un unstuck. So you just wanna put you a good amount of glue on inside the bottle cap. You know, just rub it around like so. And you just want to place your image right in the cap. Now that we have glued our images to our bottle caps, we are going to get our rears. These are our rears. And they are going to be glued. You're gonna take your, um, your glue and you're gonna glue them to the reel. But for as your rears, they have a little, um, metal thing here triangle looking thingy I don't know what it's called this little metal piece here that holds this black piece and the end of the um the holds the batch you want to take your needle nose and you want to open it up not too wide Turn it on so y'all can see. But I got it in there and I'm just gonna open it up and it pops right out. This little thingy my jinky. If I can I don't know what it's called, but that but it goes right through there. Like so, and then it goes on um the end of this black piece. But anyways, you want to get you something, 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 something to hold your, um, to hold your string. Because if you don't, it will be lost forever. <laughs> it would get wrapped up in there and it would be lost forever. You would not get that thing out. So I have some tape here. It's not the tape that... Um, I normally use I normally use painters tape um, I don't have it I don't have none with me nah! so I just got some regular tape and I I hope I really really hope that this works you guys let's see oh this tape stinks baby it smells terrible And you just want to put the tape on there like so just to hold the string so that the string will not, you know, 
go back up in there because it will be lost. So while that's doing that, you're gonna push this through and you're gonna get your string out. And you see here, it's a little knot. You're gonna cut it right there at that knot. Like so, you're gonna pour this all and you're gonna add your beads. So, I'm doing these, so I'm gonna do this one. Then I'm gonna do this one. This one and the last one. <coughs> so it should look something like that. How cute. Okay. So now we're going to put this piece, this thingamajiggy back on here. The right way. Make sure you put it back the, right, the way that it was. Mm, come on. Okay. So, you got this little piece back on here. That was really hard. I don't know why. It shouldn't have been that hard. But it was. He wanted to give me a hard time. Why? Okay, so now you're just going to tie a knot in here. That's what I'm doing now. Tying a knot. And um, I'm going to double knot it. So, make sure you double knot it. And like so. I don't know if you guys can see that, but there you go. I double knotted it. And now I'm just gonna take my lighter and I'm just gonna go over it just to be on the safe side. Not enough to burn it. Please don't burn it. But you're gonna slide it back down and you're gonna add your little triangle looking thingy back to it. <clears throat> but you're gonna take your needle nose and you're gonna close it back up. If it stay, don't nothing wanna corroborate today. I'm getting over, I'm just getting over strep throat, you guys, and I'm just catching it today. I am catching it. Okay, so now we just attached it. You can now take your tape off. See, that's why another reason why I like to add the reel, add the um, cap to the reel later because you have to tape it and if you glue it, then it just be, you know, all over the place. So with that, um, this is going to be for this one. Look how cute that is. Look. Look how cute that is. A Mickey Mouse. How adorable. Minnie Mouse. Mickey and Minnie. Because this is Minnie and this is Mickey. So how cute. <laughs>
Okay, guys, finally, man, that seemed like it took forever, like for real, for real. But anyways, um, we got all our beads on our reels. I'm excited. Okay, so now we just got to um, glue our caps to the reels. <music> are done they not dry but they are completed um look at this one look how cute it's black history month it's for black history month so it says black history honoring the past and inspiring the future how cute and then you have this one it says teacher teach love and inspire and then what well, I have two of these and I have this one it's a this one is Cupid's favorite nurse I have two of those and this one was a personalized one Mickey and Minnie, how cute. She got her name on it. How cute. Yes, 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 yes. So with them being complete, you see why I like to add the balls before I add the reels because it's a lot of tedious work and you know it be sliding off and falling off and you want them to dry completely. So with that being said, they are done. And I am so happy of the outcome. I hope you guys enjoyed this video of my bottle cap bougie badgers. These was absolutely amazing and they're super cute. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Give this video a thumbs up and if you're new to my channel, make sure you go hit that subscribe button and turn your bell on. That way you would not miss an upload from your girl D. And to my subscribers out there, you already know, I love you guys. I truly do. Until the next time, into the next video. Thanks for watching. Bye.